Hello everyone and welcome to a video I'm very excited to film here. Uh, they're a lot sooner than I thought I was going to. You guys know by now Stitch Fix I usually, I or I do have set to be every other month, but this is a lot sooner than that. And that was because they saw my last Stitch Fix video and they were like, yikes! That did not go well. We need to fix this. So they were kind enough to refund or give me, yeah, I think it was either they didn't even ever charge me the 20 bucks or else they refunded me the 20. In any case, the $20 styling fee. I mean, essentially, if you don't know what went down in that video, A, you could go watch it if you want to, or else B, just know that they changed my stylist for some strange reason and that stylist did not do a very good job. One of the items had a hole in it and overall it just, it just wasn't wasn't a great experience like it usually is for me. I personally love Stitch Fix. For anyone that doesn't know, I just, these videos are never, or I shouldn't say never, one time they sponsored a video from me, but this video and most of my Stitch Fix unboxings are not sponsored. I pay for these out of pocket. I just love the service. I think it's fun. I like doing videos on them. It's something a little different, you know, for my makeup videos, and it's just a fun service to me. It's a styling service where you go in and you can take your style profile quiz and say what you like, you don't like, what you want, what you don't want, etc. What colors do you like? And then they send you based on whenever you want, every couple weeks, every couple months, that sort of a thing, you can get a fix sent to you and your stylist will send you five items, a mix of clothing, accessories, shoes, that sort of a thing. And you can either keep the stuff or send it back. It's all, it's all inside the box. They've got the return envelope and everything all pre-stamped for you. So it's super duper easy, no hassles just it's just fun for me it's fun for me to see what other people will pick out for me but as fun as it can be sometimes sometimes you know it's a gamble that's really what these kind of services are be it a beauty subscription or some kind of a clothing service like this you're you're gambling you really are but for the most part I tend to enjoy my fixes and you guys, <laughs> I was laughing so hard, quite a few of you did like hashtag bring Sasha back 2019 whatever or something because Sasha was the stylist that I had before and they said you know if Sasha's available they will absolutely have her style this one for me so I really hope that it was Sasha. <laughs> she just did so well. So as always, my favorite part, the little envelope that says, oh, hello. It tells you all the prices and stuff that your stylist picked out. Like I said, it also comes with the pre-stamped mailer bag so you can make returns if you're gonna return anything. And the rest of it just comes nicely packed here. So let's see, let's see what they sent. Ooh, hoo -hoo. I'm excited. Got a nice mix of prints here. All right. So first things first, this is a very tropical colored print combination for the winter here, but very, I mean, I would, I'm certainly going to try it on. I don't know that it's exactly my style. I don't mind a good button up. It feels very lightweight, very breathable. I appreciate that. This is from Sanctuary in a size extra large. So we shall see. That's definitely one that I can see like here just looking at it and I'm like, eh, but maybe once I have it on, I'll be like, ooh, this I'm certainly like ooing because it is so soft. And again, it's, oh my gosh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, this is actually kind of similar to the sweater I'm wearing, but I don't care. Oh, this is so cute. I love this brand, this brand, this pink clover brand. They had sent me, I guess, two boxes ago now, quite a few items from this pink clover brand. And it is just so soft, so, so comfy. Oh, cute, oh, cute. So this is different. Yay, I could justify this if it looks good on me. <laughs> it's just a heather gray, nice mix of the black and gray type of a material and then a nice olive, deep olive green. And it's got like this knot at the bottom, add some detail. Oh, that's cute. I could pretty much tell even before trying that on that, that that's me and I'm very excited. Now, this is also a very nice soft, thing what is it okay I don't know I don't know about turtlenecks <laughs> 
this isn't quite a turtleneck. Oh, it is, it is a sweater though. It's a sweater dress, I think. And I did, I did ask for a sweater dress the last time anyways. So we'll see you guys, we'll try this on. I just don't know that this is gonna look so great on my broad shoulders, but it's, it's really soft. I can definitely say that much. It's a like three quarter length sleeve it looks like, and this would be a good winter slash fall floral, yeah? Gray with the nice orangey floral. And then my favorite color of all, stripes. Oh, this is cute. <laughs> yes, this is very cute. So this is from the same brand. This is the Kaylee brand, which I don't think they've ever sent to me, but this is totally up my alley. It is just this nice cream and red striped dress, but it's like the t-shirt kind of material, so this is just gonna be so comfy. And then the back has the crisscross on it. Oh, that's a cute thing. Yay. And then it looks like we've got some shoes here. I have not ever gotten this like plasticky kind of a bag before, but, oh, those are cute. CVs? I haven't heard of those before, but I had asked for like some kind of a slip-on sneaker. And these, I've, I don't think I've ever seen a shoe quite that color before, but it's a nice like, teal green but also almost a foresty green i like that the soles are blue i know no one's really gonna see that but i actually really like these these are really cute i think it's one of those things where you think oh but when am i ever gonna wear this color of shoe or it's gonna be hard but i think this color of a teal type green i think it's actually gonna go with a lot more than one might think so yeah let's uh let's go try this stuff on i'm excited so first things first as I'm buttoning this up yeah I mean this shirt it's just okay for me it's not something that I would wear typically or I mean it wouldn't be like my last choice on earth it does fit me very well like you know the buttons aren't gaping across the chest or anything so that's great I love that the colors are really bright and you know, it does give me some shape type of a thing. It's just not really my style. It's not not my style. Do, do you get what I'm saying? Like I could, I could make this work and I do really like the material of it. It's not the typical kind of like sheer material where it won't breathe. I've tried to cut myself off from ever buying that material again. So this is actually a very nice, lightweight, breathable thing. And like I said, it does fit me well. I just know that I would not wear it. And after just doing a closet declutter, like why would I, I mean, A, why would I keep something that I know I'm never gonna wear? And B, why would I pay for something that I'm not gonna wear, you know what I mean? So this one, this is just, it's just okay for me. Now this on the other hand, this is so me. Oh, oh, I love it. It is so freaking comfy. The color hits like, perfectly or almost perfectly right under my bust there. I love this. It's so comfy soft and it just feels like me. I love the nodding detail. Like this just makes me so happy, this shirt. Everything about it. I love the sleeve length. I love the material. I love the colors. It's just 100% me. I love this shirt. Yay! All right, and then we've got the sweater dress. It's actually lined, which I didn't realize, so that's a nice touch to it. I just don't think it's my style. I don't know. I mean, it fits me really well, and the material is really nice and cozy. I just, this kind of a neck, I don't think looks the greatest on me. I just don't. It's a good length of dress though. I, I just, it's just not me, you know, like this isn't like that last sweater where I put it on and I want to dance around and be like, yeah, I absolutely love this. You know what I mean? But the quality is there and it's a nice dress. It's just, it's just not for me. But a dress that is really me, or at least it feels really cute and like something I would definitely wear is this one. I feel like I would like this a bit better if it was a bit shorter. Yeah, do you feel me on that? I mean, that would be a easy enough fix to make and I'm sure on normal height people, that's probably where this dress would hit. Or at least that was probably the intended place that it would hit. But yeah, I love the sleeve length going down to the elbow there. And as you can see, we got the crisscross. It's probably, yep, I would definitely wear a different bra with this. But overall, it's super comfy. It's nice and lightweight. I'm a little on the fence about it in terms of, I guess we'll see 
based on the price, like that sweater that I love, I'm keeping that no matter what. This, this is a dependent on price thing. I do really like it. I don't know how much I love it. I would pay like 25 bucks for this. But if it's anything more, which I'm pretty sure it will be, I probably won't keep it. But I do really like it. And then the shoes fit it, yay! I would need to do a much better job of lacing them. Fig your fluffy butt. But they fit, even on my fat foot, yay! And they're super comfy. They're nice and lightweight, but they feel like they've got a decent amount of support, so they'll be comfy for walks and stuff. And they've got just enough room where I can tell I can make these slip-ons if I just figure out the lacing properly. <laughs> Whew, all right, I think I'm all put back together. Now let's take a peek, see, A, at what the stylist said to me. We'll see if I had gotten Sasha back. Either way, I think whoever did this did a darn good job. Not a complete knock out of the park, but I still thought they did good. So, it is Sasha! Yay! <laughs> Okay, let's see what she said. Happy New Year, sorry about the last fix, but she's happy to style me again, yes! And yeah, then she just says to, you know, what I can pair things with and why she picked those things. And cool, okay, so apparently they, she said that they don't have any slip-on sneakers that are not Toms, but she loved the color of these tennis shoes, and I agree, and honestly, I think I can make these slip-ons if nothing else. Yeah, and then, you know, just the typical information, or the, yeah, you know, styling guides if you need help. I do think that is a really cute outfit. I just, it's just not 100% for me. Yeah. The real thing. Let's check out these prices, see how it is. This red dress is $48, which I just don't love it that much. I do really like it. I just, considering I'm getting some other things, I'm just trying to be better about what I'm keeping and whatnot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass on that one, even though I think it is cute. This pink clover is perfection. It is $38. That's awesome and perfect and exactly that sounds just right that sounds perfect to me this dress was at 54 dollars which i just didn't like it much at all so i definitely wouldn't pay anything for it personally but i mean i do it's a it's a nice dress it's well done it's just not for me oh, the sneakers hurt the sneakers hurt these are 68 dollars but i'm going to put my my 20 dollar fee towards these and make them 48 dollars and then they are way more in, you know, what I would pay for sneakers. I would still pay 68 bucks for sneakers if they're nice enough. And these do feel really, really nice. So, I mean, eh. But yay, like, I've been wanting some new sneakers. Oh my goodness! This must be, like, a really nice brand or something. Uh, this is $78? Nope. I mean, I could see, like, a retail store like Nordstrom or something selling this for, like, $58, but holy crap, what am I, what am I missing? Oh, okay, I, okay, I'm still not gonna buy it, but <laughs> no, I'm definitely not going to. Either way, there we go, my friends. I am super, super happy with the couple of items that I am keeping from this fix. Yay! Thank you, Sasha. I, I love these things, and I had a good time trying on these clothes in this fix. I mean, that is all a part of it. At least that's how I see Stitch Fix, is that it is. It's a gamble. You're not guaranteed to like everything that you get. And to me, that's that's okay. But the things that I do have that I've kept from Stitch Fix, for the most part, at least the stuff that I have kept and that I have in my closet right now from them, I really love those items and I wear them a heck of a heck of a darn of a lot time. Made so much sense in my head, and then I said it not so much. So yeah, I think that's gonna do it for me for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you get Stitch Fix. If any of you are interested in just checking out Stitch Fix or even if you are interested in getting a fix, I do always have my affiliate link down below. Like I said, it is an affiliate link, but I think, what is it? It's if you use my link, then it's 25 bucks for you and 25 for me to use on future fixes and whatnot. So I mean, it's really a win-win for everyone around if you do end up using that link. So if 
you do use it, I really appreciate it. But yeah, you can let me know if you get Stitch Fix. How do you feel about Stitch Fix? Do you feel like I am having trouble talking? I sure do at this point. Let me know if you agree about the items that I am keeping or if you think I should have kept a couple of the other things. Just let me know in general. I love hearing from you guys. And as always, you can also let me know that you enjoyed the video by giving me a thumbs up down below. I would really appreciate it. And if you're new here, Hey, hi, hello, how are you? You can go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more content from me in the future. You can become a member of my casserole family here on my channel. I'd love to have you here. And as always, my cat is jumping in the Stitch Fix box. I hope you guys are all doing well. And until next time, just stay well until then. Bye. Hey, Fig. What are you doing? I'm sorry, they don't make Stitch Fix for kitties. I will say though, these Stitch Fix packs are probably my cat's favorite boxes to lay in. <laughs> For whatever reason, they're just the right shape and size. Would you say that's accurate, Fig? He says, get out of my house! I like it clean in here! <laughs> you're so vicious, Fig. I didn't realize you valued a clean home so much. He says, I take garbage, I chew on it, I spit it out. I eat trash like you for breakfast. But guess what? It's lunchtime now. I don't eat this crap for lunch. <laughs> ooh, 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 fig, fig, no. And no sneakers. That was wild. I didn't know what to think about that.